Hello, YouTube. Um, it's been four years since I've uploaded any uh, content onto my channel, Elton J. Fernandez. But I would like to say thank you to all of you for having stuck around. Um, I see that my subscriber base has not only... I mean, it's not stagnated or dropped. It has increased. So uh, I'm extremely humbled and grateful uh, that you guys still think I'm worthy enough to be watched, which I like. Thank you very much for that. Uh, thank you for your support. It is with your support uh, that I have been able to go on and move on to doing other things in my life, um, whether it is representing uh, Maybelline New York as India's spokesperson for the last six years. Uh, I've had the good chance uh, of working abroad at New York Fashion Week, uh, creatively directing the shows at India Fashion Week uh, for four seasons. Um, it's been a great uh, journey. I mean, it's been 20 years of me having to do makeup, uh, being in this business, but I finally got tired of somehow circling back to, to having to come back to the fact that I do makeup. You know, I wanted that to be one aspect of my uh, work professional life, but not all of all of not all of me. Um, and because of that, with lockdown and everything recently, uh, I hope all of you guys are dealing well and coping well with this situation. Uh, I hope that whatever grief comes to us, that we're able to process it, uh, take it in our stride and, and, and move on from, from there, uh, from a low point into something that's greater. Uh, for me, I've spent my time in lockdown really uh, working on a personal project that I'd like to announce. It is called the Non-Binary Awards or the NBs. Now, an NB is uh, it's an English word. If you look it up in the in the dictionary, it's E N B Y, and it it's uh, for people that do not categorically believe in the binary of male or female. Uh, so, for example, I'm an NB. I'm a non-binary. I see myself as a non-binary person, even though I feel more connected to my mask side. So, I feel 80% mask and 20% femme, but I do feel non-binary most of the times, uh, which is why I like, uh, I mean, I love aspects of, you know, like my nails or I like wearing makeup or I like uh, things that aren't considered very masculine by the most, uh, most people. So, um, anywho, so the non-binary awards or the NBs is uh, my little baby project that I launch on the 10th of October this year so stay tuned uh, it is going to be a live broadcast event via YouTube so this channel and uh, Facebook live um, and probably Instagram we'll see how the tech works on that uh, our handle is the underscore NBs E N B I E S the NBs uh, so on the 10th of October please remember to check back I'll be hosting it from home and broadcasting it to uh, everybody out there and it's not just for non-binary people or for the LGBTQ uh, plus community. It's for everybody, uh, even if you're heterosexual, if you're cisgendered heterosexual, it's for you too. Uh, the point of the NBs is not just to create uh, awareness and, and encourage conversation around the spectrum of gender and sexuality at large, but also uh, and primarily to uh, raise monies and funds for organizations that look out for trans people, trans persons' welfare, for employment and their skilling, um, and really just welcoming people into our uh, into our safe spaces, uh, giving them safe space, sharing a seat at the table, allowing for everybody's voices to matter. Uh, we will at the NBs uh, recognize India's larger queer movement, uh, and while we may nod to the past and players of the past we focus uh, primarily on the future uh, and where india is headed uh, we want to focus uh, bring light uh, to contributions and skills of the lgbtq plus community or the non-binary aspect of it and i've partnered with a friend of mine called ishan bharat in delhi who joins uh, me as a visual director for the non-binary awards now this is, or the NBs, we call it the NBs, like you have the Oscars, the Grammys, and the Emmys. Ours is the NBs. Our handle is the underscore NBs, spelled E-N-B-I-E-S. And NB is uh, someone that does not categorically see themselves as 
either male or female. You know, you don't have to fit on that binary. We know today uh, that there is a larger spectrum of gender and sexuality. Uh, and so all we're trying to do is raise uh, awareness and bring conversation around that's these large spectrums uh, to show that there is not just two types of people. Uh, there's not just two or three types of sexualities. There are many in between. Um, and our primary goal is to not just to sort of nod to the to players of the past that have been part of India's uh, a vital part of India's larger queer movement, but we want to keep uh, a sort of forward um, focused view of uh, the future of India. So we want to bring uh, light and attention to younger people that. Uh, are just doing great things, have great, great many contributions. Um, and we don't have to wait around on our heterosexual allies to constantly pitch our stage for us. We can do it ourselves. Uh, so in that spirit, really, we're, we're recognizing uh, players that have been a part of this queer movement uh, and that will be a part of a larger movement in the future for India, taking India in, into the future. Um, so the non-binary awards or the NBs is scheduled to launch on the 10th of October this year. So 10-10-2020. Um, make sure that you prepare yourself to attend because you, uh, you are invited. Everybody is invited. This is not just for the LGBTQIA plus community. It's not just for people who identify as non-binary. You can be anywhere on the gender and sexuality spectrum and you will enjoy this event uh, because all it is really is a celebration. A celebration of a people uh, that that are taxpaying citizens of this country, people with skills, people with contributions, uh, people with a voice, uh, people with uh, sensory organs, just like all of us. And everybody has a seat at this table. Uh, we want to hear everyone's voice. And sure, this is something that's the first of its kind in a sense. So uh, we are going to come face uh, challenges. Uh, we are going to make mistakes. Uh, and I really want, the point of it is to learn. So while I may be a bit anxious about these, uh, about spaces that I'm learning about right now as I tread along, uh, but I'm excited to learn from them. So by all means, uh, join in. We're going to be dressed up like we're going out to uh, a big awards night to celebrate, but we will be in the comfort of our own home in the spirit of lockdown. Uh, and the reason I'm keeping this purely digital is so that I can, at least as of now, the first year, one, because I want to, I want to tread gently and sort of see uh, how things are uh, accepted, how, how they're seen. I want to know that I, when I make mistakes that I uh, cause minimal disruption, um, you know, I, 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 I'm very sensitive to the fact that I do not want to offend anybody, um, knowingly at least, you know. So, uh, and I wanted to keep the cost of the event down so that whatever money I do raise can be used, uh, put, put my money where my mouth is in essence, which is uh, we will be raising funds to uh, present to organizations that look out for trans persons' welfare, uh, for their skilling, for their employment, for their advocacy. Uh, yeah, we want to challenge uh, the status quo, in essence. So stay tuned, uh, because I will be having this, hosting this event live via Zoom. Until then, fingers crossed, maybe each uh, do what we can in our own spaces to provide safe space and extend our, the, 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 the love and the courtesy and the respect that we want for ourselves. Maybe each find uh, the humility that it takes to extend these uh, blessings unto others as well. Stay safe. Have a great evening. Ciao.